Orege damu nyitoge ni dhini wa channel ito ya FM Show KE and also right now. Omo the need the 23 of February 2024. Kumbuka tarehe na tatu mwaka uliopita mwezi Februari. Ndipo tarifa ziligonga vyombo vya habari ya swa kuhusiana na kifo cha kijana Jeff Mwandi. Kifo na story ambayo iliweza kuli kuweza kuligaragaza jina la msanii tajika na maarufu sana hapa nchini Kenya DJ Fatsoa kitajwa kama mhusika mkuu katika mauaji yale ila baada ya kesi na uchunguzi kufanywa na tume ya uchunguzi ya DCI mashtaka yote aliyoekelewa DJ Fatsoa yalipata kuondolewa ila kwa sasa ileo it's one year na tunasema tunasherekea one year anniversary ya kifo cha Jeff Mwadi na kando na hilo ambaye amepata kutukumbusha taarifa hizi kupitia ukurasa wake wa kijamii ni blogger Simon Mwangi Modiora ambaye ndiye alikuwa wa kwanza kuweza ku blow the whistle aswa kuhusiana na kifo cha Jeff Mwadi na kuwataja wale walioshukiwa kama wahusika wako so kupitia ukurasa wake wa kijamii wa Facebook Simon Mwangi Modiora e, ni asha kaite kukea Jeff Mwadi Dudaamu wa kamugima kumari rea Jeff akuire pamoja na mamake Jeff Mwadi. Na amesema hivi Simon Mwangi Mudiora. One year down the line, we all know your precious life was taken by people who now drive and party around. I have taken this week to mourn you as a son, a friend, and a hero who had a bright future ahead. Jeff, you lived ahead of your time. You are an incredible genius, a piece of wonder, and defied heart, and a beautiful story. You shall forever remain in our memories. Your killers and their handlers and caretakers I shall know no peace. We loved you, beautiful son. You are truly missed, our beautiful Jeff Mwadim. Akachia na emoji za kulia pale. Na kwenye comment section mamake Jeff Mwadi akitambolekana kama Mwadi Anita Babes aliweza kuongea na kusema hivi mamake Jeff Mwadi Another years passed of me being here without you There is not a single day when I haven't missed your presence and your warmth around me son Akae kana emoji za kuvunjika moyo Na wa Kenya asoa katika comment section ni ma you meritie na wige mono makio ma, magisha kaya mwako mwe kumari ya Jeff Mwadi ya kuire. Na adrenda kutho makoment siya kenyari ya na ure ya maraiga. Dine wa comment section yeno ya uh, Simon Mwangi Modiora. Magma ke hii ke heke ya Jehovah nasema. By now Jeff would be working in Gulf earning nicely and making a mom proud. But to say menini shetani alifanya mambo yaki alafu wakasema alijiwa. Tell me nani anaweza jiua akiwa na bright future kama ya kwenda Dubai lakini ni sawa wacha waendeshe Benz siku moja zitakosa brakes ili melori nyuma sisi hapo road trip hadi kwao tumzike huyo shetani hmm? Rashford Jerry Vishak anasema hii ndio ile kifo iliniuma sana ya mtu hata siku anajua la time we fought for justice huku social media and sleepless nights Jeff you left so soon son i pray your mother gets peace that only the good lord can give you siraisi keep resting baby boy adu wakafanya mwili yako ifukuliwe na they still denied you justice ah uh, washira jackson akaiga his killers are still wandering around and forcing themselves to people it will never be the same again their lives changed completely Helen Grace can get the most painful stories to tell Jeff and Rita Waheni. Eh uh, Bonnie Kitinga kidiga anasema, mhm, mm nitaki kutaja majina mimi. Karimi Karimi anasema Jeff we tried our best to fight for your justice. But their money bought freedom. We left it to God and one day the truth will be known and that when you will rest. Mary Bogwa kaiga May Jeff continue resting in internal glory may his killers know no peace maroregwo ginyaniteri wakataliwe mpaka na vumbi grace kenya juu ya kai got this boy will lie continue resting in peace jeff i was 
I was your, your die-hard emotional battalion, but God in heaven knows better. May your soul keep resting in peace until we meet again, son. Eh, hado ige, ni mayumiriti na kunyitanira na family ya Jeff Mwadi. Amo na blogger Simon Mwangi Mudiore, ure wa yumirie. Agetuika newe huwari frontline koro gira eh, justice ya Jeff. Eh, and I can organize it. This man, this young boy who was my age mate, was a dreamer like I am. I can say he is like a brother to me. What else can I say? Because some of these things, once we speak about them, it's not about the stories that we do or the narratives that we push out here. It's about us as human beings. Because this would have been anybody's son. Uyu angekua ni mtoto wa mwana mke mwingine ya kule inje. Uyu angekua ni ndugu yako. Uyu angekua ni mwanao. Uyu angekua ni ndugu yako. Mm, ya rafiki yako. Yeah, that's why sometimes such cases and such stories, we don't do them for lies nor views. We do them because we want even the God in heaven to hear us cry, to see us tear up. Because... Our hearts, once we listen to these stories, once you even go through social media and pass through a picture and you meet the picture of Jeff Mwadi over there, I tell you, you always feel it. It always comes. You always feel this boy was never given the justice he deserved. But who are we? We left it to the hands of the law. But we are told that the law was bought. What else can we do? There is a God in heaven. Kuna mungu bigoni. Na tulisema yote tumemwachia. Allah subahano taala. Mwenyezi mungu wa bingo na inchi. Haipigania kia kejef kama jinsa bavo tulisema. Eh, sina mengi. Ya yeah, leo tumkumbu kejef. And we say salute. O one year you have left champion. Your family misses you. And your brothers misses you your emotional battalion on social media there is no justice that that has ever been fought for like yours what were you talking people who never knew you but they were willing to die for you keep resting in peace jeff ulipendwa ila uliondoka na ukaacha pengo katika maisha mamako anita mwadi yeah mia yako sasa e ni fm show ke Nie, wenda waje takada ya kirenyaga kana MC Fireboy. Make sure ume subscribe, share, like and comment.